Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to the channel. My name is Cap, and we're on day 48 of our Darkness Falls series here in Seven Days to Die. Uh, let's see, did a couple things last night. Got some cooked chili going. I got some cooked sham going. Got this stuff right here that I need for the challenge. Still need to kill five animals. And I looked at inventory. I actually have all the necessary stuff to build a coil pistol. And I have a little bit of extra. I have a coil receiver and another coil receiver, uh, coil pistol receiver and a coil rifle receiver. So maybe we'll find some more parts of those. But for now, we can start making ourselves a coil pistol. Now, how long will this take? That will take, oh, level 51. That's not bad. All right. Now, one of the things I was looking at here is that uses 44 magnum coil rounds okay that's what this is right here we need to have bullet tips bullet casings that are steel and coil batteries so there's a whole lot of stuff we have to be able to get going before we can even start making ammo coil batteries going to take scrap polymers lead and electrical parts i have some of this stuff here i might as well start making it as much as we can uh let's see the scrap, I'm doing okay on lead is where I seem to be a little bit low on, and mechanical parts right here. So, if we can try to make, let's see, we can make, we need the coil battery, that's, the, wait, where do we have to make this one at? Oh, the metal workstation, okay. That would be right here. Coil battery, and, oh, I need, I'm sorry, I grabbed electrical parts, I thought it said that, for some reason I thought it meant mechanical parts. No biffing. Let's go back to here. We can do one. I, <laughs> I'm going to craft one, okay, just to kind of get a, a ballpark idea as to what it's going to take to make a truck ton of ammo for this. I'm fully aware that I need to start grinding out scrap and lead. I think, if I'm not mistaken, right on the other side of the horde base where we first started, there was a small little iron ore above the ground. And if that's the case, then I should be able to... Um, maybe go ahead and start digging a hole there. Get my uh, food back up here. Put you right here and you right there. I realized that was the difficult way. Let's see. Is it done yet? Nice. We got us a coil pistol. We're getting closer to being able to go do the reward. Range damage 11 versus this one is it's 11 as well. But supposedly this one is just better. It's a revolver. It's a six shot 44 coal or coil rounds. Oh, nice. Okay, so doing just one gave us 50 battery. Okay, 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 cool, cool. So we needed that. Uh, bullet casings, we need iron and clay. We have a lot of that. I'm going to guess I'll probably need to make, let me see, iron. We'll do that, and that's a decent chunk. I'm going to guess I need to make those over here. Bullet casings, steel. Let's see how many we, we holy crap, that'll take a little while. We still got the um, the steel going on here, so what we can do is we can kind of get this queued up. So how about we'll do 50 of those, just to kind of match what we have there. And bullet tips, uh, let's see, do we need, let's see here, for the coil around here, for the bullet tips, lead and clay. I, I think I was making some, uh, where would I have put that? Would I have put it in here? That would be a logical spot for it. Got blunder buy ammo in there. Did where did I put the did I put the bullet tips in here? Or did I Oh there we go. I was making some hollow tips. Alright, I need to make regular bullet tips too. Okay, we can do that. We can get all these going on here. Bullet with an E. Bullet tips. Oh, okay. We need we really need to get the advanced forge going, which is one of the reasons why I'm making the forge steel. Because you can see the difference is one lead. Oh man, we're not gonna have that much lead. Crap sickles. Okay, how many can we make? 13. Oh, it's going to suck. We need to find some more lead. We'll get all that going. Kind of let it do its thing. Let me put you in here for now so I know where you are. I'm just going to put you right here as well. All of this stuff I can drop back off of here. I'm just going to let you kind of do your thing while I'm in the process. I need that, that, that. I don't need that or that or that. And that's food. Okay. All right. So while we're waiting for this to kind of turn away and do its thing. What time? Oh, it's only 745. Good. Anybody out here? No? All right, we need to go hunting. You can see we have the kill any animal uh, quest still activated. So what I want to do, just quickly glance around real quick. There's a couple animals. Two Owen Wilsons running around. Wow. Okay, I saw a deer over here last time we drove past. It may be a little bit further down than what I can possibly see for now. I can glance around and see what's near the house. If I can get this quest completed... We can start working on getting our coil pistol ammo going. Oh, hold on. While I'm standing here, um, I think I want to head out that direction where there's a little bit of like an open area. All right, let me look. I could have swore 
there was like right here somewhere right around here I, let me see if I get lucky if it was right no that's not it there was an ore right around here somewhere and I'm sure I could probably find it again if I put just a tiny little bit of effort into it but it would behoove me not to dig a giant hole right here so what I need to do is just kind of keep an eye out for an iron ore so I can just go to town on that one where's my bicycle out here we're gonna save a little bit of gas We've been using our mini bike a lot lately. I would re there's two engines that are available for the mini bike. There's the turbo mod, which makes it go faster, which would so be beneficial because I'm tired of plodding along slowly. And then there's the other engine that allows you to be or to have better fuel efficiency. Hang on, is that lead right here? Let me let me see real quick here. No, that's uh, that's uh, iron. I might as well go ahead and grab this right here. I have an iron mine right there, so I'm not worried about that. You see, there's a little ore sticking up all over the ground here, so I'm not worried about being able to find it. One right over there. We just need to keep an eye out for animals. But I forgot what I was saying. I have no idea where I was going with that. I assure you it was important, but I don't remember what it was. We're just looking for some animals to kill right at the moment. Uh, we almost always run across a bunch of animals over here, whether we want to or not. Let me see. I think this might be iron. Or not iron. I think this is steel as well. No, this is iron. Okay. So what I need to do before I do anything else, I need to go ahead and put right there just so I can keep up with it. Let me get a little bit of lead here. There we go. Took a minute to find the actual ore that's underneath here. It's kind of off at a weird angle, but even then I'm not 100% certain I've found it yet here. It's just kind of... There we go. There's the lead down there. Okay. So, we should be able to... I'm not going to spend a lot of time right here. i got other things I want to do, but I thought I would at least grab some so we can start working on some more. Uh, yeah, I kind of dug myself into a hole. Definitely not the first time. Oh, we almost made... There we go. All right, so we'll keep that right there so we can find it next time. Keep it... Wait, is that a... Hang on, what are you? Are you just a survivor? I don't... I think you're just a survivor. Tell you what, I'll leave you alone for now. Ooh, cow. That, that, does that count as an animal? Let's see. I want to get a little sneak damage. Yep, that counted. Sweet. Somebody's running around over there. Hey, you. Can you go take care of Big Mama? Oh, Big Mama got the click. Let's see if we can get a sneaky shot on Jiggles over here. Whoops, we missed. She's like, what was that? Those mosquitoes are huge here. Oh, it got me. Can you handle... Oh, he's just straight beating her down. I almost feel bad. Almost. Go over and get this cow meat real quick because it's mine. I almost feel bad about that. But I have I have to say, going for the headshot right there, it definitely uh, put it out of its misery without any kind of pain. I mean, that cow was just like, ooh, check it out, grass. And holy crap, we almost fell off the hole. That's not what the cow said. The cow said, like, moo. Oh, hey, look, check it. There's another one. Sweet. Go ahead and get a sneaky shot on you. Bink. Sweet, sweet, sweet. That's two. You know, if I only get to kill five cows, that's fine. I could always use the extra meat. Trying to get our hunter thing going on here. We do have enough stuff in the book. Or we do have enough material to be able to make another book to get yet another class completed. We'll just have to see if we do or not. Uh, you know what? Give me your oranges while I'm literally standing here. Jiggles is back on her feet. Good for you. Good for you. Can't keep a good woman down, right? Hey, look, another cow. Sweet. Sup, cow? How you doing? Well, you're not doing very good anymore. Like I said, I'm trying to be. I'm trying to be somewhat. It's not really called humane. I guess I'm trying to be humane by taking them out in one shot right in the dome. You know, just trying to be nice. I think my bike just ran downhill. Yep. All right, let's see if we can get a, a look around. Hey, stay right here, man. Uh, what do we have over here? I see what looks like an animal. Out there is a bar. I don't think we could take him out in one or two shots. Those things are fast. He come, I'm going to not waste all the ammo on trying to kill a bear. Ooh, does a bee count? Oops, we missed. Did it count it? Ah, oh, I didn't count it. They do give you some honey and some rotten flesh, but I'm not going to drive all the way over there to get it. I'm looking for animals that actually count towards my kill count for now. Excuse me, sir. Have you seen any more cow around here? I'm looking for your cattle. Or a deer. Or a chicken. Or anything that's going to give me food that counts towards my kill count. 
Ooh, there's a rabbit. Idiot zombie's gonna scare it away. <laughs> Jiggles, look, I'm trying to get the rabbit. Can you leave me alone? Bruce, is she with you? What are y'all doing out here, man? Are you unable to get a room? I mean, there's a lot of empty houses around here. I'm sure if you put just a tiny bit of effort into here, you could probably find a room for the night. Or at least a temporary hole in the wall to do what you gotta do. Alright, well, let's look around here. Rabbits are just hard to kill. They're freaking fast, and the moment they see you, they're like, nope, the hell right on out of... D oh, wait, there he is. Don't move, Mr. Rabbit. Hold on, I, I gotta... Gotcha! Ha <laughs> ha! Gotcha! Come over and get me some fluffy cottontail here. Alright, now where'd you go? There you is. I don't think I've killed a rabbit in this game yet. Kind of curious is uh, if my little stats thing show... That's the wrong one. See if it shows rabbits down here. Rabbit. Rabbits. Oh, okay, so we've killed two. That's only the second one in 48 days. Now, I'm going to be fair to myself. I have only tried killing two. So, two for two is not bad. I know I've tried to run over several of them while I was on my adventures and failed, but, you know, that's neither here nor there. You didn't see nothing. That's why I put that on a shirt. To let everybody know, shh, you saw nothing. Alright, we need one more animal to have this quest completed. Give me something easy, like cow, deer, uh, chicken that's kind of just hanging out, not doing anything. Something mostly stationary so I don't have to chase it down. What are you running to or from? Okay, you can go take care of Frank over there. I don't care. Jiggle, see, look, that house is that house is available. Go for it. Surely you've been saving up after all this time, right? I always tell you, put 10% in savings. Do you listen to me? No, you blow it all on things we're not going to go down that path let's just hey there's a spider i'm going to guess that probably doesn't count towards the quest either but i'll go ahead and kill it just for giggles where'd it go there it is hey mr spider whoops we missed whoops we missed we got it did it count it yeah leather boots gloves hood chest armor and leg armor well that's not anything i need i can make some of that crap let's see all right, let's see what we can make. Uh, boots, chest armor, do we need that? Yep, chest armor, leather gloves, do we need those? Yep, we do. Can't make the uh, that one. Do we have to make the hood? Yep, we sure do. And the leg armor as well. Get all these going, won't take very long. Use a chunk of my supplies. We can start heading back towards the house in case... Oh, there's a... Hey, look, there's a wolf. We could have killed that. Wait, where'd he go? How did I lose it? I was literally just crossing... There it is. I didn't need that specifically, but we went for it anyway because, again, free meat. It's here. You know, I really haven't had that many dealings with wolves, and I probably shouldn't say that out loud because that's a good way to get a pack of them rolling up here. I know in the Wasteland series we had a few times where a pack of wolves come rolling up on us and just showed up out of nowhere. It was like, hey, what's up, dude? You got any food? Wait, you are food. Can we go ahead and eat you, or maybe not? Here, we've only seen the occasional one. Uh, we have only had one or two actually charge us, so it's, it hasn't been too bad with wolves. Dogs have been... Eh. They've been okay. Birds have been the biggest problem, like they always are, but, you know, we know what we're going to get when we deal with birds. It'd be nice if we... Oh, there's a chicken. It'd be nice if we could find a, uh, a place to dig a mine closer to the house, you know? That, I mean, we have our little uh, we have our little mine right over there for iron, which we definitely need to get in and do some more mining on that probably in the near future. It'd be nice to have one real, real close that we can do so for lead as well. I'm sure there's probably one close by. Park you right up here, and are you almost done? You are done. Kill any zombie, kill any animal. We just did that. Oh, with a pipe rifle. Do I have a pipe rifle? I think I had I had one in here. Oh, dang it, I gotta go find animals again. Alright, whichever one of you out there are hissing a lot, can you not? Let's see, that's hunting rifles. Where's my pipe rifle? If I had one, where would it be? Wait, never mind. <laughs> Shut up, you didn't see anything. You don't know. Do I have ammo for this? I do. Oh, this gun sucks, but maybe since I'm a little bit higher level up, maybe I can get some kills in easily. The animals seem to be the hardest things to find lately. 
I didn't want to have to wander all over the countryside to do this. Now, I don't want to go inside a house with a pipe pistol because it's a single shot. takes a month to reload compared to everything else I have. So if we can find some stuff, I guess we'll just kind of wander around a little bit. There's almost always a zombie roaming around over here. This is going to be one of those things that now that I'm actually looking for them, all the zombies are going to be like, nah, we're not going to show up here. All right, I see one up here. Again, the animals is probably going to be the hardest thing to find, basically. Uh, you're a... You're not either one of the things I need. Have you seen any zombies around here? Or maybe some cow or anything useful? It's a restaurant. I bet they know where the cow is. All right, we're going to, tra uh, we're going to travel down this road a little bit because there's some more wooded area over here. Look for some moosen. See if we can't find any. Or a zombie. You know if I wasn't looking for one, they'd just be they'd be all over the roads and stuff right now. But of course, since I'm... Oh, there's one. Okay. Uh, I don't know if this thing has the range to hit him from here. But we'll let it square in and see what happens. Did we get... Ha-ha! We got him. I'm calling that a good... I think that one's a little bit out of range. Oh! Ho, ho, ho. Look at me going full on beast mode. Snappy snaps with a terrible rifle. No scope, iron sights from a half mile away. Or 50 yards, whatever. It's close. You don't know. Shh. I just said that. There's, uh... Oh, hold on. There's Gary. He doesn't see us. Shh. Damn! There's Kyle. I don't... Surely not. Uh-oh. No, sir. You don't count towards my rewards, but you get to die anyway. Give me your honey. Two jars of it. Sweet. Okay, we didn't get to take the shot on Kyle. Ah, we missed. He's a tweaker. I'm blaming that. I'm blaming the whole tweaky bits thing. He's just bobbing and weaving. It's hard to hit. Ah! Can't hit him from that far away when he's all... Hey, hey what's up, Lois? We can definitely hit her. Yep, she went down like a sack of rocks. Come here, Kyle. Gotcha. All right, so when the tweaker got close enough to actually hit, we got him in one shot, too. So far, the pipe rifle is okay. It's not something I want to take into a horde night by any stretch of the imagination because I just imagine it sucks real bad against things running at you when you have to reload one at a time. Uh, you know what? I might as well, while I'm literally standing here, of course, it's just feathers. I need more eggs. Uh, my own nests may have respawned, rejuvenated, replenished, whatever. Ha whatever the actual phrase is for there might be crap in them again. It might be a thing, but probably not yet. I'm not sure if it's even been a full 24 hours. So now I just need to find five more animals. Last time we got lucky, or last time, literally... Five minutes ago in the same video, we got lucky and found, what, three cow in a row? Hey, Tom, have you seen any cattle around here? Oh, I see one right there. Hey. All right, don't move. Uh-oh, holy crap, reload faster. Oh, okay. We need to make sure we get the sneaky, sneaky damage on these things or they're going to kick our butts. All right, make sure you're reloaded. That's the wrong one, unfortunately. All right. Hey, Jiggles, have you seen any cow or wolves, chickens, pigs, pretty much anything? I'm pretty sure I've seen a Bob's around. Or not, yeah, Bob's? No. Yeah, Bob's boar. That's what I was going to say. I'm pretty sure I saw a Bob's somewhere up in here. Would be a good way to find some pig. But I don't remember where it's at. Maybe it's been one of these down these side, road, side roads. The word road does not have an L in it, despite me trying to pronounce it with such. Do as I do, not as I say. <laughs> Where's Bob's? Oh, got a wolf right here. You don't see anything. Gotcha. Sweet. That's two. We still got three more to go. We're kind of tooling around here. I, ha I still haven't found Bob, so I'm not sure if it's... I swear I saw one in this town at one point. Because I think I remember saying something along the lines of, Yeah, nah. Let's look around see if there's any other animals traipsing around right here there's definitely no animals in the prison all right so that row takes us back to our house i don't think it's on this row i don't remember where it was at 
which I did, or if it's even in this town. It could have been in the other town, you know, one town over. All right, well, let's just keep looking and see if we can find some other livestock roaming around here. Ooh, a cow and a wolf. Nice. Okay, see if we... Oh, we got a bee swarming around here. Let's see. All right. No, no, no. You can't get the kill. Uh, leave me alone, bee. You know what? Hang on. There we go. Got to keep it quiet here. All right, Kyle. Leave my wolf alone. I need to be able to get two kills here. Uh, there's one. I'm sure the cow didn't hear any of that. Okay, so the cow may have heard that. Come on over here, Bessie. There we go. That's two more. Good God. If you haven't noticed where I'm at, I drove all the way down here, rode up and around here, and all the way back up to here before I finally found those two idiots. It has taken forever to find animals in this game, other than these stupid things flying around. I saw a bunch of bees. I was about to say, it didn't give me that, did it? I only need one more to complete this stupid quest. Go ahead and gather up your innards. Did you happen to have one more friend with you? Just one. I just... I, I don't even care what it is. A chicken and nothing. Frank, you're going to have to just mind your own business here. Don't be puking on me just because you went out for a late night bender and can't quite make it home before dark. Not my problem, man. Sylvia, <laughs> have you been drinking too? You're stumbling a lot. Holy cow. All right, there we go. We got a deer right there. Got him. Quick shot him. Quest completed. Six out of six. Yeah. We completed the trainer, the hunter thingy. And here's a whole bunch of crap we don't need now. Oh, finally. Holy sweet Jesus. Man, that was a lot of backtracking around nowhere here. Now we need to get all the way home. I know I passed a lot of iron deposits. Like, I'm sure some of these are probably iron. It wouldn't hurt. Since I'm nowhere near the house, it wouldn't hurt to go ahead and grab these. Uh, let's see. Is this iron? No, that's... Might as well bust you open real quick. This... No, that's not iron. This is... This is more steel. That's not iron. No, these are all the same thing. Level 52. Sweet. We got three skill points to spend. All right. Well, dang it. I was really hoping to get a lot more done today, but the animals are proving to be rather elusive. And so I basically just don't have to get back home. And we should be able to start getting closer to make another book. I need to see which other class we have left to go. And to see if all the stuff in our forge finished here i really want to get the advanced forge going that's probably needs to be the next big thing i work on just because it would save me so many supplies when i'm having to craft a lot of this stuff like the bullet tips and the casings and advanced forge while it will take me a lot of resources to get it going once i do it'll definitely save me a whole hell of a lot of things and uh, i think you can do a whole lot more multi-crafting on that one too hey we've seen a decent number of spiders today that's kind of cool I mean, I'm glad I didn't get hit by any of them. It was poisoned or anything, but it's kind of cool to see them nonetheless. A lot of traders are wandering survivors around here tiptoeing too. All right, well, let's just get home first. Okay, made it home, and our trap and our nest have not finished doing their thing yet. Let me check real quick and see how this is doing. Got 500 of that one. Let's see here. So if I got, that's not, I think I have some more cement in the house. For some reason, I didn't bring it out here. Let me double check. I can make some more. Yeah, okay, well, that's where I put all my cement. Go ahead and put you right here. Let's see, cement. Oh, I don't have any more crushed sand over here. I could make some crushed sand. How much can I make of this? Can I make like, what's the max I can make? That's a lot. How about we do 200? And for now, I'm just going to put you up here so I can keep track of that. All right, so let's see what this is doing. I'm going to guess it probably ran out of wood. Yep. Okay, so four minutes. We'll just do five, get you going. Nice, we got our forged steel. I guess I probably need a whole lot more than that. What do we need for the advanced forge? 250 steel holy sweet jesus oh that hurts that hurts so bad oh 
All right, well, let me drop off some of the crap I have on me that I don't need now that I completed all that stuff. All right, let me put the rocks back over here so I can keep up with where they are. Whoops, that was just stupid. All right, so I can put you down here. Let me see, for concrete mix, we need the crushed small stones and the cement. That'll bring it up another 200. That'll be, that'll be all right. We can let that run for a little bit. You can just chug doing your thing. Get as much cement as possible. I have... From all of gathering here, I have somewhere, I have like 144, 145 rebar frames. That could actually be quite beneficial. Uh, what were you working on? Oh, you were done. Were you working on anything? Nope, you were done too. Close the dough. I put my key cards in here. I have six and one and one. Just so I can keep an, keep up with where they are. I need to drink something. I need to... There's so many things I need to do. I'm not even going to act like there's not. Okay, let's see. We'll get... Oh, let me resort this here. I see I've got more than enough clay and all the holes that I've been digging. I'm getting a ton of it here. So what I need to get you doing is making a bunch more forged steel. See, look at this. When I get the advanced forge, that's what I'm trying to show you, just in case you didn't know. It takes 10 and 2 in an advanced storage, in advanced forge. In this one, it takes 20 and 2. So it takes half as much resources to make those. All right, so I have a... Let's see, I need... 250 right I have 250 how many do I need uh, let's see I need 145 more to go okay all right oh it's gonna hurt to use that many resources here can I make a hundred not that many can I make 145 52 minutes that is not gonna be done anytime soon but you know what let's just go ahead and put a ridiculous amount of wood in here just so you can keep running keep doing your thing and i don't have to come back and check on you you know one thing i am glad about this forge versus just like a standard forge is that this one doesn't make any noise see listen nothing like the standard forge the workstation the chemistry station all of those just make a buttload of noise all the time when they're running and it's obnoxious uh let me see real quick run over here we don't have a whole lot of time left in the day all right so i'm going to kind of tell you guys the general idea of what i have um i want to extend this bridge goes out because this is let me see what one two three four blocks high so if i keep the bridge going up at least three blocks high all the way across so what i want to do is i want to bring it straight out to about here right about here so it's one straight path from right there and then i'm going to have it go off this way and this way and have two separate stairways i've had a lot of people tell me cap if you have them funneled into one general area that it can cause problems there it really doesn't i've I did this in the wasteland series i've done it several times before with a massive horde as long as they can get to you even if it's crowded and they you know keep running into the iron bars and stuff like that as long as they see it the game sees it as a way to get to you they will continue to just run up and fall off over and over again it's when part of the path gets broken like right here or they dug this hole here and they couldn't get up there that's when they decide, you know what, I can't get to you anymore. I'm going to come in here and break apart all of this. So if I get a layer all the way underneath here, uh, break apart this rock and do another layer of concrete underneath, reinforce all of this all the way up, get it concrete too. I'm going to have to break apart this. That's going to be sad to watch it crumble because that's a lot of resources that I could probably use again. But I, I really feel confident that having a funneling base where they have two stairwells, and if it's going down this way and this way up to a straight point, then from where I'm sitting up there, I can have a direct shot while the traders are still doing their shooting at them, so they still have plenty of time. And I can hit both sides with Molotovs, and they won't have this blind... Oh, that was stupid. Of course it did. I won't have this blind spot when they're right here, when they're behind this other kind of column right here, and I can't seem to get to them. So that's the plan. I do have faith that will work. I have confidence it will. We'll just have to see or not. It's only day 48, so I don't think he resets until, until tomorrow, but I've got a little bit of coin on me. I need to check to see if he has anything that would be beneficial for... A nickel ain't worth a dime anymore. Yeah, I know. Uh, let's see. Do you have... Wait. Yeah, you do have... Okay, well, do you have any new recipes? Chemistry detection, concrete mixing. I already have that. Uh, let's see any other work better crafter never mind okay I just thought I would see let me see if he's got anything on him that would just be extremely useful to have 
Okay, well, he didn't have much on it. I went ahead and bought 100 bullet tips just because... That's all you're gonna buy? I'll let you show yourself out. You can do a whole lot of things. I uh, figured buying the bullet tips would be at least beneficial because I'm going to have to make a bunch of that coil rifle or coil ammo anyway, and I need it. And it saved me a whole bunch of lead. Now, like I said, I knew at one point there was... I want, I want to look around real quick close to the house to see if there is a lead deposit that I can start digging in. Um, I need to do some upgrades to the actual house itself. I've got wood all the way around this side of it here, and some of it is upgraded at least once. Fall in the water hole. Let's see real quick if there's any that are just like super -de duper close that I could start mining and not have to drive all the way back over there to do some because it'd be nice to be able to just kind of hang out at night and do all this uh but i know that we'll reach a point very quickly where lead is no longer the problem and we need to have plastic so what i'll probably have to start doing is like just go back through these houses here and just destroy everything that's not nailed down but we're coming up on the closing end part of the day here it'd probably be okay time to um start wrapping it up not a whole lot left to do. Did I ever check? I did check the neighbor's mail. I almost said that wrong. I almost said neighbor's nail because, yeah, that's just where my brain is at right now. So I'm going to run home. we got to basically just wait on a whole bunch of things to get crafting. If It's not going to finish before morning. At least I don't think it will anyway, especially since it's still crafting the other things. Let's see where it is. Okay, so it's it's working. It's doing its thing here. we we got the bullet casings. We've got the bullet tips. We've got 113 of those let's see where we are on bullet tips oh yeah that's the other ones here and did i put anything in here that would hey look there's some bullet tips up there i knew i had some but the steel bullet casings i know that's all i've made so far so for putting you right here Ooh, hang on let, let, let me just kind of see while i'm literally standing here uh i probably have to make you right here coil rounds how many can i make 50. okay well that's how many i kind of thought i was going to be able to make let's craft that that's going to take a little bit of time. You do your thing. Sweet. And we have, we'll have 50 rounds for this for a pistol. I know that's not going to be enough to be able to fully do what I need to with it. But, you know, it is what it is. So, yeah. <laughs> anyway, but I'm going to go ahead and wrap this one up here. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, do me a favor leave a like on it. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe if you're not already so you don't miss out on future videos. And in the meantime, you guys have a wonderful day. And I will talk to you later.